hello and welcome back now in this particular tutorial we're going to go through how to set up your environment for getting started with uh, machine learning all right so um, previously we have seen how we can um, set up the environment for um, for our Python and uh, statistics and other concepts that we have learned so far right so now we're going to see how we can set up the environment and uh, what we need the tools that we're going to need when we are um, when we are learning the machine learning when we are learning the machine learning concept okay so um let's get started with it uh we're going to need um these tools that i've given over here that you can see on your screen uh we're going to need anaconda then pycharm we're going to need sublime test and also um google collab okay so some of the time i'll be um doing the coding in anaconda using um, jupyter notebook or jupyter lab and uh, sometimes i'll be using google collab most of the time i'll be using google collab right they are all the same i mean whether you're going to use jupyter notebook or um jupyter lab right or we are going to use google collab they are all the same okay you can use either of them when we get to the deployment part we're going to need um pycharm and also sublime test okay when you get to the deployment part we're going to need these two so for now for us to get started we're going to need these two over here okay so you just you can just click I, this one is hyperlinked i have given you a link here so if you've not downloaded it yet just click on it if you click on it it's going to take you to your browser and then um you're going to see the page like that right where you can download for either mac or for um windows or for linux okay so you can just come all the way down here and uh, you choose your version that suits your machine okay and then you do just the normal download and i'm sure by now you should know how to download these kind of um things okay for the um the other one is the google collab right so for google collab you don't really need to download anything i mean it's just going to use your browser and uh mostly i prefer google collab because it's going to store all your your files in your drive you can open it anywhere that you go right you don't need to really carry your laptop with, with you before you can use it okay and it doesn't consume your laptop memory because if you're using say anaconda right uh where you're going to use jupyter notebook or jupyter lab most of the time it consumes your memory because all everything that you're going to do all the files are going to store in your local computer right? and they occupy much 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 of your space if you open jupyter notebook they actually occupy a lot of they use a lot of your memory and then you find out that your laptop is getting heated up or getting crashed or sometimes it freezes right that's why i like google collab you just open it in your browser and uh, all your files get stored in your drive right on your google drive so i mean you can use the third one um you can open a new book or if you have a existing notebook that you want to use you can also use the third one as well right so these are the two main tools that you're going to need right that is anaconda and uh, google collab okay so once once uh, you have downloaded if you have downloaded anaconda you can just go to your system and uh, you can just search for um anaconda navigator okay so once you you see that one you can just open it right and uh, that's what you're going to use in this uh, i mean during the machine learning class right and i'm sure by now you should know how to i mean open this anaconda and use either google collab or i mean jupyter notebook for this all right okay so you can either use the jupyter notebook a jupyter lab or the jupyter notebook right either of them is fine right we can use either of them to follow along this um tutorial okay and uh if you're using the google collab then you can also um just open your collab notebook and then you get ready to um practice along okay so that's that's what we're going to use in this tutorial okay we're going to use the, these two um two so far i mean for now okay in later on when we get to the deployment part we're going to download pycharm and then sublime test okay we're going to download pycharm and sublime test to work along right but for now just keep um anaconda and google collab ready to practice alone okay all right so um in the next tutorial we're going to start with the ml algorithms right that's the most exciting part of this course i mean learning the algorithms is the most exciting part but we're going to start um by learning the intuition behind them right and uh the mathematics behind them we're going to we go to the lab and see how it is i mean done in the in the industry how we implemented these algorithms okay so um it, it's going to be excited um from from this part on 
and I encourage you to enjoy the most. I mean, this is the most excited part of this um, course, okay? So, I mean, um, put your seatbelt on and let's get started for the last session.